Hi, how are you? Wait, I can't think. I was just hi. I'm just up in the night at the moment, which is pretty good. So um, uh, hello. If not in the night, give me a chance. So um, hoping I get to stay for a while this time. I'm helping everyone with the with reach or if pre down or something. You can still think down into your heart to me, Terry, for immediate needs. Thanks. Or you know, hoping for anything in the future as well. Or I'm thinking. Um, it's um, um, Jehovah's Witnesses who came to my door. And, um, yeah, we're, we're, we're going to be, uh, um, we were talking, yep, yeah, I'm go going to be talking to their leader. <coughs> she, He's describing himself as a friendly pole <coughs> version, and um, so we'll, we'll see if he's how he's how he improves. So, anyway, so I was just talking to them, and then they, they go well, talking through a tract and a pamphlet and I'm handing out about the end time. If you have any problems, you can come and just don't let them in. I, I stood at the door and talked to them, I didn't let them in, and um. Uh, uh, if you if you don't even want to talk to him and say I don't want to talk through the door, I don't even know. Her. So so many of us have been triggered by by stuff like this. Everywhere, you, if it is totally within our rights not to talk to somebody about religion or religious beliefs, absolutely our our basic rights, and we can if we want to, but not if the other person doesn't want to. That's right. Yeah. So anyway, um, yeah, uh, came through the wall and didn't try to break in. It was cool. I spoke with them, and they they were just showing, talking with me about the pamphlet, which was about what it says in the book of Revelations. That oh, the beginning of the thing. Thank you. It was um, uh, do you believe in 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 the future there'll be no more suffering? And um, it says yes, no, no, no don't know something. So I said yes, and, and he moved on to the inside of the pamphlet, which says about the book of Revelations, which I quote you know, a lot. <laughs> um, and he was just saying what it says in, in the book of Revelations, that uh, in in the end, you know, there's the end, apocalypse, Armageddon, whatever, new heavens, and um, there'll, there'll be, God will be with us, and there'll be no crying, and no mourning, and no pain, and no suffering, and no death and yeah so um that stuff's cool i was explaining to them that he was saying there'd be no there'd be no death at all and then i was explaining to him that probably the only death he was saying there'd be no need for hospitals and stuff and we we use healers and stuff like that and really the only only cause of death um in the future for for those who who keep being Good and or holy and or enlightened and or meek, in other words, righteous, no matter what religion, yeah, is um is to you know, <laughs> is to um uh, uh well Jesus is is the way for Jesus Christians, that's for sure, but he's not the way for non Jesus Christians, and God the Creator didn't just create Jesus Christians or people who are going to become Jesus Christians. It's just a fact, isn't it? So you, yeah. Anyway, thank you. Um, that's right. So um, uh, mm, yeah. So I was explaining that uh, the probably the only reasons anyone would die who got through to that stage would be if they didn't have a contrite heart and or repented and they still had they're still evil and they tried to do something evil. Or they hadn't um, healed emotionally or psychologically, or, or from past emotional things, and and or physical things. The healers would take care of that. Yes, absolutely. And they got there, but 
um, it's really important to keep working on your emotions and, and um, psychology because sometimes it does cause physical illness like cancer and stuff. Right. And um, yeah, I, I'm still a really firm believer in not forgiving. Just um, when somebody's healed enough and you have a person who's, who's abused them and has healed enough, then loving, having compassion, forgiveness makes you sick. Because most people, when they try to forgive, they, they, um, they say, you know, you abused me and I apologise that I got in the way of, of you wanting to control me. I know I'm nothing and, and I really want to, to approve of, of that opinion of, from you of me. So let's not do the forgiveness thing because it's crap. See, that's that that the idea that they think they have a right to abuse anyone is incorrect. Nobody has that right. Abuse is not supposed to exist. Evilness is not supposed to exist. It's just not. The balance of power, some people call it balance of power, it's not even supposed to be in it. Good and or holy and or not and then or meek only. This is the way it's always been. This is the way it was supposed to always be. And, and it will be that way again. So, catch up. Inside. Mind, heart, body, spirit, soul, and actions, speech, thoughts, everything. No evil. Heal. Get safe. Listen to guidance. Don't put yourself in, in situations that are bad for you or bad for others. Or that, that, that you're going to be... Yeah, I, that's why I said I'm going to be tempted to. When you pretend to be my assistant, you're not. I don't need your assistance. Um, don't get banned. Don't bring those people here. Amen. Anyway, so um, yeah, so um. Um, unhealed emotions and psychology will be uh, might be a cause of death and um, also if, if they're being evil of course they might have accidents and stuff like that after those times as well so there you go um, and yeah he was saying that yeah, he thought that people needed to have Um, have mercy and um, wanted God, God's mercy for, the, for their sins and stuff and it's just it's really that if you have a contrite heart and repent that the mercy is from yourself to do that for yourself to actually let yourself get healed and, and guided so you, and protected and helped so you don't do mistakes, crimes, sins again and and um so that's yeah, I just love it on. So um anyway see you next time. No, it's just the whole thing's really You know, they they sexually abused them when they were children. And they said it was because of drug use, it was because of they fancy it was because of possession, it was because of was so all that stuff got stopped. I, I helped her and said, I just helped her and said, and and so, and then, so eventually they died, and then they got born as their children, and the same things happened again, but to them, uh huh. And so we will fix that situation, and then more children got born to them, and the same thing happened to them, and. And we fix that, and, and then, uh, huh? Are they all points for that anyway? This is ridiculous. I, I mean, yeah. There, yeah, there's hardly any of them left now. And and they're, they're the ones that you thought were the best hope for. Uh, um, I'm starting to get annoyed. I'm starting to wonder how stupid I actually was to think they weren't like the others. I'm I'm seeing signs 
that they're worrying and that I should worry for everyone else's safety and yeah this is not good you know so you know I mean uh, I don't freaking think of me unforgivable since you don't you don't get me wrong deliberate of your own free will doing the unforgivable sins you don't get reborn from that you just don't it, oh. others have done this and and let's look at what that what's happened because of that let's look at it i mean really the holy spirit was right originally unforgivable sins they don't get forgiven they don't get reborn they don't get regenerated they don't get resurrected the spirits don't go in clones bodies they just don't because why should anyone else have to suffer because they're stunning conversationalists or they're good sexually or they're perverts and are genocidal to everyone else and thieves and they are the enemy no matter how good they look. Yeah. Just thought I'd say. Cause... Yeah, I do. I have crushing on to mom. And especially, it's just like, what are you doing? Gosh, I'm going to have to die. Can you just stop doing it? Can you stop? Yeah, just intervention all the time. Intervention all the freaking time. Mm -mm. Well, yeah, but uh, I mean, why? Why is it coming on? I don't, I don't. Am I missing something? A am I not looking after these ones well enough? I mean, pray for me. Oh, excellent! That would be excellent. Thank you. What a good idea. If you can pray for me too, because they, they were just these ones were just like totally meek and and you know yeah oh, so yeah don't forget to pray for your souls as well please please pray for everyone who's good and or whole and or not and then the meek especially the vulnerable please yes thank you for seeing it um you see you next time thank you thank you for listening thank you